Good evening. I am getting ready here to stream Dragon Warrior 4 Randomizer Seed of the Week. This is a new seed that was rolled for this week's seed because the original one that was rolled uh, had a bunch of bugs in it. So we are going to give this one a try. Hopefully it won't have any bugs and hopefully we will uh, be able to have a good seed here. So. Anyways, uh, Taloon is uh, beefed up more in this flag set. It is the flag set with the vanilla resistances to the bosses, so we can't just go Aeolusing our way through. And uh, we have a really good Taloon who does a lot of insanities, which are either merchant armies or critical hits, so maybe we'll get to see Taloon do some cool stuff. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and get started here. Okay, it's doing that because I just probably reset the wrong way. I haven't played this yet, but sometimes I just let it start and then I reset. So anyway, we'll get the timer started here and get going on this seed and see how it goes. Let me just get my pad of paper here so I can take some notes as we go. So let's get started here. Three, whoop, three, two, one, nope. I uh, wait a minute, hold on a second. Let's reset this here. I just, uh, I started the timer too soon. My bad. Okay, so let's try this again here with the Dragon Warrior 4 Randomizer Seed of the Week. I'm actually trying something a little new here. Turbo is not on, and then once I hit the first input, I could turn it on, so... I kind of mispress the buttons there. So let's do this here. Three, two, one, go. There we go. That's how we wanted to do it. Hey, we got Old Man Soldier Bray. To be nice to Bray, we could just say he's a very experienced soldier with a lot of wisdom. Okay, he's got 33 attack power and Infernos to start. And he's got Infernos and he's got MP to use it too. So that side of things is looking pretty good. Not much here within our price range. And not much, there is an Aeolus, but that's not gonna work. So there's no point in going after that. Stiletto earrings. I will take note of that. And that's it. All right, I would say let's give the tower a try. We don't know what we're going to be up against, but we do have Infernos, and Bray's got some strength, so we might be able to get Bray a little... Let's see what we got here. Oh, mirror shield. Uh, Bray, will you... Oh, nice. There we go. Bray's got some defense. Very good start. Mm, they're all broken up into separate groups. I'll try something. Staff of Anti-Magic. Bray. Oh, Bray's got attack power now. We're in very good shape with... I mean, sort of very good shape, I guess you could say. Bray. Much better than his club. Antidoterb. All right, this might be able to do something, too. Just don't take all of Bray's MP. Oop. See you, Bray. That didn't quite work. What's down here? Okay, that's where the cave is. Let's just keep working on the tower here for now. Okay. Ray's level is looking pretty good. That's a 
some pretty good uh, strength and HP gains he's getting. I like that. Mm. We might see... Yep, kind of figured that would happen. We might actually get enough... Uh, Experience here relatively quick to fight the shadow, so let's see. We might be able to knock him with Infernos, let's see. Yep. Oop, almost. <laughs> Bray's going crit happy. Probably can you yeah, we might be ready soon. Um I'm thinking we should give it a shot. I mean, he's got 89 HP. I'd like actually his HP to be a little higher, like maybe over 100. I don't want these guys calling for help, because that'll just be extra experience. Yeah, his HP is kind of tapering off here a little bit, but I guess we could just give it a try anyway, see what happens here. finds that Ray got, I think that might help. I mean, we don't even really know what we're up against on the Shadow yet, so in that sense, you know, we could be up against a really easy Shadow here. Oh, okay. Wooden Hat's not the greatest, but it could be a little boost. Yep. Alright, let's go uh, take on the Shadow here, see what we're up against. I think Bray's strong enough now. At least to uh, give this a try and see how things go. It's two of them. Alright, one down, one to go. Alright, cool. That wasn't too bad. Oh, Bray's getting his, uh... HP again, so... I think Bray's gonna be a good Chapter 5 candidate. chapter until I get rid of these kids. Nope. We'll just... Ooh, water flying clothes. Okay. Um, oh, this is a weird uh, map design. Just out of curiosity, Bray will, ooh, Bray will take water flying clothes. That'll give him breath resistance, too, when we're in Chapter 5. So they have stiletto earrings. I just want to double check. Do they have, uh... Okay, no, I thought they had a uh, mirror shield here, too. Okay, so... All 
All right, so Berlin's got stiletto earrings. Bray is, I would say, great for chapter five. Okay, the only other thing I noticed here, I'm just gonna fix this on the splitter. I realized I didn't put it on averages. There we go. The seeds can always vary in this, so I don't like to do PB because we're not... It, you could have a really good seed that goes really fast and get a PB, but then you could have another seed that is really difficult, takes a while, and then you could have a much longer time. Like, it just really depends on the seed, so I'd rather compare it to the averages. Um, I just find that it works a little better for randomizer that way, so that's why I do that. Meow. Okay, let's just head right down here. Actually, I didn't even look at Crystal yet to see how Crystal is. Okay, we got Hero and Taloon. Let's see. Crystal, you got 28 attack power and blaze. Hero's got Stop Spell and 25 attack power, so both can attack. Uh, let's see here. For now, I'm just going to give that over to Taloon. I mean, we could give the thing a try just to see what happens. I'm going to put Taloon in front, though. Christo in the back. Taloon could call in a merchant army here, so that would be kind of cool if he does. Okay, a couple of Somna Beetles. I think I'll have... Um, let's try Stop Spell on the Humanoid, just to see if that will lose sap. Doesn't work. Okay. Oop! There goes Taloon. Uh, let's do it that way. Hero's gone. Oop! Taloon! Taloon is very good. Oop! There he goes! Merchant Army! Let's go! But Taloon's stats are not very good. Mm. Not too impressive, Taloon. I mean, HP's are below average, I would say. Christo looks like he's above average. I wouldn't say that he's eh, average, above average. I would say above average on Christo. Okay, so we're going to need to... Let's take a look at this. Staff of Force. Okay. Um, Christo. Oops. Uh, hero. Maybe I'll actually give that over to Hero. Although we might be able to sell it for something good if we do see something better. Let's just see if we can uh, find like some kind of weapon here for... Um, metal Babel Helms are actually kind of cheap. They have Swords of Lethargy here. That's good to know. Um, kind of expensive... Uh, whatever that other item was. Is that a chain sickle or something? Alright, so let's see if we can avoid the swamp. Uh, maybe we can get hero level. Oh! Okay, heroes, uh, good. Not bad. Oop, see a saloon. That's actually fine for now. Uh, 
Okay, so... Uh, I don't know, maybe just buy some chainmail for Christo. And they sell Aeoluses here. I think that wooden hat was pretty good. Oh, there we go. Told them to take a wooden hat for 33 bucks. Expensive metal battle sword. Got wings. Let's get some wings. Okay, just loading up on some wings there. Now we will head out and head over to the cave. This is a really weird map. Oh, early golden bracelet. Let's just run back out because we're basically right there. Um, yeah, I'll attack. Oop. Uh, maybe I should. Oop. I missed. Menu there. Not ready to die yet, but. Alright, we'll just, uh, let's get the uh, fake princess kidnapped here. And we will just grab that thief's key and then we'll just dive the rest of the cave. Cave has two chests. Actually, no, let's do the bird song tower. Uh, because yeah, I want to do the bird song tower because the bird song tower actually has um, we can wing out of the top if there's nothing there, but in the cave we would have to death warp, so it actually makes more sense doing the bird song tower. Four chests in each place, so um, in that sense, it's not really like we're getting more or less chests. didn't quite work out. Alright. Or actually I should have been in front of him. That's alright. Might have to take a few more fights in here. I should probably should have hero life for the fights, but oh well. I might just try to run anyway. Gold and metal slimes. <laughs> All right, Taloon. The 
these types of moves that Taloon is doing, this is getting to be... Making me want to use Taloon more. Well, it should give us an idea of whether Cristo might be good to use. And that, actually, that metal slime should probably put uh, Cristo in pretty good shape for the tournament, too. To fight in it. Yeah, Cristo's just kind of average now. Kind of below average. Um... All right, more gold. Probably be enough to try out the left. Oh, another metal slime. Go get him, Taloon. could probably use Hero here to get a few more levels, but that's eh, alright. Alright, we'll check this top uh, spot, and then someone's going to get wiped out here by whatever they were. Lizards or see if we got a vanilla bird song nectar. Nope, fairy water. All right, so let's wing out of here. Let's go to Tempe and just check the sort of lethargy situation. Oops. Okay. Christo. Nice job. Christo will equip a sword of lethargy. So I guess the bird song is in here. We I wouldn't say it was a wasted trip because at least we found out that Christo can equip the sword of lethargy. Lots of encounters. to the bottom. So the bird song nectar is in the golden bracelet location. We'll fight him since that Vampire bats confused. Oh, never mind, he ran away. Well, we'll see if the demon stump drops anything. Oh! Ah, I'm gonna say no to that, because. Ah, uh, yes, let's get rid of that leather hat. All right, let's see if we can death warp out of here, and I don't know if we can death warp on this guy, but we'll try. I actually don't think I equipped... Oop, never mind. I don't think Taloon's going to let us death warp. Hmm. 
maybe he'll death warp on these guys. Uh, never mind, those guys aren't going to let us death warp either. I don't know, did I equip? I didn't equip Cursed out. I actually do want to stop in the bazaar, because I think we have money for one of those Aeoluses. It's probably more for defense, but um, we don't have... I'm going to give one for hero. Let's wing back to s wing back to sand team here. Take care of this. Okay, just making a few notes here. It'll save me time later, because otherwise I'll forget where a lot of stuff is, and then what's going to happen is I'll uh, so we can pet the cat again. Um, I'm going to forget, and then I'll be wasting a lot of time looking around for everything. So, Strength C. Uh, sure, Taloon, you can have a Strength C. All right, let's get over to the tournament. Uh, it's over here. Let's get Christo through the tournament and get out of the chapter. Endor is at the south part of the map. Uh, I'm probably not even going to go to the source here. So you got anything good? Not really. Well, stiletto earrings, but... Okay, so here goes Christo into the tournament with a Sword of Lethargy. Uh, I didn't even heal him up. Should probably have him use his medical herb. Okay, he's just got surround. Sword of Lethargy doesn't seem to be working. He just keeps attacking and there's no sleep. Samson's asleep. We'll hold on to that herb just in case Linguar decides to play the game of jumping around. Alright, let's go for A. Oh, it's D. So we'll chase the Linguars. We'll go for D. Oh, and C. We'll go for C. 
unless we notice some kind of pattern. Sometimes randomizer does that, it creates like some kind of pattern. Z. Now it's B. Yeah, I don't know if I'm quite seeing a pattern here, but... Oh, <laughs> that works! Okay. All right, let's go. I think we got a little bit of money left, so maybe we'll just stop at the casino, um, spend the money on casino coins, just in case they got any goodies in the casino. We can get them in Chapter 5. Okay, so we can get 78 coins. Okay, they got a chain sickle and full moon herbs, so not too much. If we get the um, casino coins when we're going through the tunnel, then we can maybe get a dragon killer or metal babble helm. Uh, what am I doing? I got a wing here. Okay, well, that was a pretty, time-wise, pretty average Chapter 2. Um, I did take that little bit of a gamble to see if the Birdsong Nectar was in the... Uh, Alright, Boomerang. Anything here I should know about? Not really. Just in case Alina takes a fight. I mean, I'm probably not going to level Alina here, but... Um, Alright, not much here that we need to know about. Um, just kind of average stuff. Uh, there's Bomalma. Let's go take care of this. Prince Reed gives the wrong princess a hug. Actually, I'm gonna... No, not the quick evasion. Uh, let's sell that boomerang. That way I can buy some wings here. Probably should be more than enough wings. Let's um, spend the night at the inn, and let's check this shop over here. Sometimes if they got armor and it's progress... Ooh, uh, that could potentially work. Yeah, sometimes if they... All right, let's go... Oh, that's Foxville. Anything up here? Nope. And nothing up there, so indoor must be... Oops, getting nighttime. Uh, let's see if we can get to endor before Alina dies. Okay, good. So let's go save. That way we can mark this as a return point, so if we die, we come back to Endor. All right, let's wing back to Balmama. We'll take care of the Prince's Letter and the uh, Royal Scroll now. So we'll go up here, talk to the Prince. Wing back to Endor. We can do this little glitch here where we can stop in and go see these two guards here. The guard that will kick you out right there. And this guard who's just standing there doing absolutely nothing. Bring back to Bomamo. And we'll stay at the end. Oops. And 
questions, we will head up here and read the Royal Scroll to the King. And we'll wing back to Endor and we will go treasure hunting. Treasure hunting for a silver statuette. Probably should have got some herbs, but I didn't. Maybe there's an herb right here or a silver statuette. Yep. Yuck, sandglass of regression. I cannot throw it away, huh? All right, well, the good news is at least we hit the switch. See you, Alina. Oh. Maybe that guy can't damage Alina. Yep. Alina is still alive. Uh, dragon nail. Maybe that's better than the cloak. Oh, she won't take it. That might be worth some money, though. A venomous dagger, Alina. Okay. We'll have her give it a try anyway. Iron safe. Doesn't have much money to keep, but... She can keep what she's got. Got a few more places down here to check for a silver statuette. Alina with one HP, an iron claw. I don't know. Venomous dagger is better. Hey, it's a silver statuette, just what we want. Let's dump, uh, I don't know, I guess a wing is fine. You never know, we might be able to grab one more chest here. Money, that's good. Before Alina dies. Oh, more money. Since we're here, I might as well just grab the rest of these chests. Oh, more money, okay. Now we'll just try to get an encounter to knock off Alina's last HP. There we go. All right, let's do it. Let's go get permission to own the shop. And we'll go sell that silver statuette so we can have money to buy the shop. a shop over here so we can buy something to sell in the shop. Uh, I guess we might just do some cloaks of evasion here. Uh, not quite enough. All right, let's see. Um, nothing here for like 2,000, so we'll skip that. be good to go once we uh, buy a few more things, but I mean, once we start doing a reselling here. Actually, I probably shouldn't have gotten that, whatever.
Can't get rid of that sand glass of regression, huh? Later on, that would take it. Later on, when she turns this shop into a vault. Alright, got $12,000 to spend here. Might be a little more. Fourteen. Uh, not quite enough for a sword edge, but I guess we can do a couple of dragon shields here. So now with that 20, over 20,000 gold, we should be able to get... I don't want to do the Metal Babel Helm, because that will uh, not sell. And then we will be stuck with it, and we'll have to start the reselling over. up to 37,000. That means we should be able to buy two Sword Edge Armors, plus maybe a uh, Dragon Shield. have enough yet from this. It's possible we might get the 60,000 gold, but it's going to be very close. Oh, cool. We got it. All right, let's go. Let's just do a quick save. Let's get out of here. Remember, these pixies can be dangerous. Yep. Yep. I saved. It's the further cave. Five hundred gold. Let's see if we could just buy something here to carry on into. But there was like a cloak of evasion here for uh, twenty-three hundred. Yeah, whatever. At least it gives her a little defense when she's making that walk over to the. Uh, Okay, good. So we're getting at a chapter three here. Relatively average time. Might be showing a slight time loss there because the... I think the averages got brought way down when I had that glitched seed that I did, where it was only like a two and a half minute chapter three. All right, so we actually could potentially have a Nara Mara Chapter 4 here, but it looks like Nara might be potentially switching places with Mara, or I don't think we saw Ragnar yet, so we could have a soldier here too. Nope, it's a Nara Mara. Oh, a Metal Babble Armor, okay. Neither sister will wear a metal babble armor. 
we could bring it into chapter 5, or we could try to sell it for some other stuff. Don't know what we're going to do yet, but... And let's just take... Oh, Mara's got exploded. That could be very good. She's got iron eyes, so... That's probably not going to be used. And a shield of strength. say yes to that. Alright, well those, um, at least uh, Nara's got some attack power with that iron fan. Shield of Strength might be useful. Let's go take a look over here just to see if there's anything that can get us through. Mm, not really. Alright, I think we're just going to run through the swamp here. I'll hit that cave in a little bit. I just want to check the towns here. Alright, Actempto. I'd like to hit Keeves here. Uh, where is Keeves? I'm trying to decide whether I should try to fight them. Doesn't have enough MP for exploded yet. Let's do this. Uh, actually, no, let's run, because I think they're going to die. Just to get them restored. Let's do a quick dive here into Actempto. Just to see if... Uh, find any quick items, maybe get some quick experience. Oh! Ah, super stick. Okay, Mara not looking very good. very good either. Hey, cool. Good find. So, if we can get a little more experience for, I mean, a little more MP for Mara, then we might be in good shape to use Explode It on Balzac. I'll just check this chest anyway. Oh, hey, that's a good find. Alright, so it's Mara that has exploded, so I'm going to try to stick some of this other stuff onto Nara. Nice crit. I'm actually going to put that shield of strength on Mara just in case we want to have her use it if she needs to be healed. And I am going to put... Nara in front because we want to protect Mara so Mara can use Explode It. That's not good. Right when we're almost at the MPC. Alright, let's go. Let's 
try not to mess around too much. Once we get the NPC, I'm actually thinking that maybe we will give Balzac a try, see how the fight goes, and... Oh, okay, Nara might be turning around a little bit, and she got some... something there. Ice Spears, ooh, we should be in great shape for Balzac. Oops. We got Healy. Okay. Oh! Okay. Oh, a do of the world tree, okay. We'll take that. And a wing. Alright, so let's head out. Let's see uh, how Balzac is and kind of take it from there. that I haven't seen, uh, oh, you know where Keeves probably is? It's over this way. spend the money on something, so we'll get them iron shields, I guess. And we'll just check these last two spots here. You never know what we're going to find. Stinky smelly scent pouch. And abacus of virtue. Okay, so now Mara can attack. Uh... 
All right, and it looks, from the looks of it, it looks like uh, Chapter 4 land is on the east side of the map. Piece of information to be aware of. Sage of Stone, so might as well use that. One left. Got him. Okay. So I'm just making a few notes here. Nara's below average, and I'm just saying Mars bad. Part of me is think, and actually, I just want to make sure nobody learned by kill here. Nope. Uh, this is Hayville. All right, cool. So we're getting out of um, chapters one through four in under an hour. So, slightly above average time here for chapter four. So I think the main thing that put us ahead though was the good chapter one. I mean, it was a pretty good chapter four too, so. We got our hero, Ragnar. Get Ragnar a few extra HP, that can always help.
use the fairy water just in case. Okay, there's Bronca. I remember... Oh, here, might as well check this place. You never know, we might get something really good for Ragnar here. Nope, just two lunches in case Ragnar gets hungry. Alright, here's those tunnels. That one there is the uh, symbol of Faith Cave, that one that's not surrounded by the swamp. Gotta find the least swampy way to get in there. This is this way. Hey! We got the casino coins! Woohoo! And there's a couple things in the casino that we can get too, so um, that's actually a pretty good find. I think there's a uh, dragon killer in there and a metal babble helm, I believe. Oop, we don't have money to stay at the inn. Actually, it doesn't really matter, because... Okay, we just got Taloon. Let's see who we get over here. And we got Alina, okay. Not really too crazy about the party, but um, gonna use Alina or not, but, um, Taloon seems to be the most beefed up right now, so we'll just use Taloon and maybe he'll just call in a merchant army and knock out whoever these bosses are. Nope, he'll just trip and knock him out. Nope! <laughs> Got a Sword Edge armor from a healer. Hey, Taloon. Got a question for you. Nope, he won't take it. If I'm not mistaken, though, I think Alina... Alina and Ragnar. Ragnar could probably use a slightly better armor, so we'll give that to him to replace his Wayfarer's clothes. Alright, 
right, so we're just gonna try to get through this, go get the wagon, and then... We will start our treasure hunting for Z items and a gas canister. Or actually, no, we gotta get the wagon, then we gotta get the boat. Guess we will get Ragnar and Alina some levels just to see how they do. Let's see, who do we get here? Doran, okay. Let's do this. Tulum, Doran, Alina, Ragnar. Eight hundred and forty-five damage. Oh, Alina seems pretty good. Ragnar seems pretty good. Okay, except for zero HP. All right, there's the lighthouse. Let's see if we can find Conanbur so we can have a return point. Oh, there's God's Eye. Is this Conanbur? Yep. Let's see if they sell wings here, too. Uh, no wings. Uh, not a bad price for a Sword of Miracles. Doran has wings, but he won't use them. Alright, no wings here. Let's do this. Give Ragnar that half plate and let's give that sword edge over to Alina. Actually, Saloon, I got a job for you. Praise this. Uh, actually, I'm going to give that to you, Saloon. Alright, let's go. Couldn't find any wings, but... Alright, go Doran. I think Alina might be pretty good. We can find her a good weapon. I think she should be in. Ragnar, my main concern is his HP. He's barely getting any HP gains here. Oh, well, maybe it's... Now his strength's down. He sacrificed his strength for HP. are a fake Taloon. You're not a real Taloon. This is the real Taloon. doing too good here. First couple levels he had some good strength, but... Oh, got a magic key. We'll take that. Matter of fact, I'm going to pass that over to Ragnar. 
I'm going to start passing some of the junk over to Ragnar here, because... Ragnar's probably not going to last too much longer here. Oop, he's out of space. Let's just use a couple of these lunches here. Uh, you know what, let's do the same with... Oh, there's the Fire Serenity. So, I'm wondering if we might have, like, Taloon, Bray... Taloon, Bray, Alina, and Hero, maybe? Maybe Christo? Oh yeah, Christo equi- Ooh! Ah, that was a mistake. Uh, poison here. I guess I don't have a, uh, no, no antidote herb. I right, just gotta be careful when I turn. Flashing kind of can throw things off a little bit. If healers drop sword edge armors, I'm definitely gonna try to fight healers when I see them. Got some money. The only other thing that we might find is the Padecchia seed. Ooh! We need blizzards, huh? Ooh. Get out of there! Alright, Taloon. It's all you. and you're poisoned with 7 MP left. Uh, this is not actually not looking too good. Can we at least grab this last chest? Yep, money to lose. Okay. Okay, so we're... Oh, wait, not that way. This way. Galena. Single enemy encounter should be quick and easy. Alright, one last shot here for a Padecchia seed. Money instead. 
So we will need to dig out the Padekia cave. Three of them, okay. So let me get that merchant army in. There we go. Go Taloon! Good job, Alina. Okay. So Christo's definitely going to be in with his Sword of Lethargy. Um, ooh, Alina's starting to slack here. We might just have to see who else will equip Swords of Lethargy. Take it from there. Now Alina's not looking very good. Before, she was doing pretty good. Now she's slacking. Ugh, yuck, Alina. She's back in. All right. Okay, so we're gonna head, oh, there's the Z armor cave too. We could check. Um, let's see who we got here. Oops, I went too fast. All right, we got Hero. So now well, we can just see what's around here. Uh, that might be... Yeah, that's locking Abba down there. Uh, not good. Not good. Let's go in here to Bomalmo. Oh, we gotta make it daytime to get the wings rats, okay. Just thinking to myself, we could, uh... All right, yeah, I wanna get some wings. Actually, the hero's got a few wings, but let's load up, um, Alina with wings. Just out of curiosity, let's see what's over at this shop here. Oops. Oh, more wings. Um, which I don't know, I just went to Endor, but... Okay, so first place I'm actually going to go is I'm going to sail over to, uh, that's Bomomo. That is the lighthouse? Yeah, I believe that's the lighthouse. Okay, oops. This is Cascade Cave. Okay, so let's go to Tempe.
Oh, it's Ragnar that can take a Sword of Lethargy. Hmm. here. Nobody else can take a Sword of Lethargy. We'll probably keep Ragnar, but if almost anyone else, probably except for like, uh, here's a castle. What's this? Soretta. Let's do this. Let's get the boat over here. Check to see if there's anything else. I mean, there might be more stuff on that island, but... Um, this is Berlin here. Let's do this. We'll go check Berlin, see if we can... ...find any key items here. Okay, no key items. Uh, let's go back here to Berlin and we will continue sailing around. Uh, Garden Burr. Don't know who I'm going to stick in there yet, so we will just mark the location. Uh, These guys go a lot. Uh, we might be able to throw a fairy water. I guess we don't have any fairy waters. There's another castle. Uh, we could actually go take care of this trigger here with the orange guy. If I'm not mistaken, I'm going to go to Conenberg because I think on the east end of the map is where Chapter 4 land is. Uh, what castle is this? Dire Palace. This is a bunch of Chapter 5 land. Let's see what we can find here. Oh, cave. Baker's Cave. Another castle. I'm going to kill this Trixie Urchin, because... That'll give a little extra experience here to um, Hero and... Remember, Hero is kind of low with his experience. Yeah, Hero looks like he'll be good for... He doesn't equip a sword a lot. Ooh, he got heal all, too. That could be really good. And he got increase. Yeah, this is actually a really good Hero, so I think Hero will definitely be in... Oh, did we just make a big circle? Hmm. 
Check this one chest up here. Grab a leaf. All right, we found Mintos, so. This is a really big piece of land. No jobs. I think we actually explored all of this. You know, I'm going to do let's wing to Dire Palace. I am wanting to find chapter four. What's this? Oh, cave we need to go in. We gotta get that Pedekia seed. Yes, I could use a wing. Get rid of that lunch. Hey, let's go. Go to Loon! Woo! Uh, that's not looking too good with Hero. seems pretty good. She had a few bad levels there, but I think she's making a comeback again. Hey, there's the Pedekia Seed. Um, okay, so we'll be ready to grab the other three party members. Oh, more Metal Slimes. Go, Taloon! Woohoo! Oh, go, Helena! Man, Taloon's already at level 26 with all these metal slimes he's been knocking out. check the basement because there could be a staff of transformer stone of drought down here which we might need so we're gonna go check just to make sure oh, come on don't poison uh, we did get an antidote herb so we can use that on Doran just to avoid the Mushrooms with a sort of lethargy. Oh, 
Okay, so we got the Padakia Seed. Didn't really get a whole lot. Or did we get a whole lot else? We got some wings, but... All right, well, we got that all taken care of. Uh, is this the crypt? Nope. Little big plot of land. What's this? Roseville? Seaside. Let's see what the items are here. Agility seed. Antidote herb. No, thank you. All right, let's... Uh, somebody's got a wing here. Let's wing to... Soretta. We'll go trade in the Padekia seat for a Padekia root, and then we'll go get the other party members. Alright, Mintos. Okay, so now we're going to get three more party members. Um, I think the only one that I wouldn't mind leaving in Kilion would be Mara. She was pretty bad. Nara was below average, and Christos in Kilion definitely going to see who we... Oh, we got Nara. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to go to Kilion to get Bray. I uh, mean, to get... Um, uh, whatever, Christo. Let's go back to Tempe, because I want to check... Actually, I could always have Taloon check. Um, uh, I put it into Ragnar's inventory. Ragnar, no, okay. Well, oh, N Nara can, okay, Nara can take, oh, good, good. Okay, so Nara, she was not, she was below average, but I think um, she'll join the party. So let's give... Evaluate this magma staff so you can take that. Just Ragnar and Taloon. Stick it into Ragnar's inventory. And let's see this shield. Let's see who will take that shield of strength. Hero and Ragnar. Antelun, okay. And that metal babble armor. Bray. Antelun. Tulum's so jacked up with his defense. Um, Alina, Ragnar, Mara. All right, my thoughts are let's go find. Kilion. Uh, what happened to the boat? Bray was good, but I don't think we're going to have Bray in the party. I 
guess we're probably gonna have to ditch Alina, I'm thinking, at this point. to get the wag, uh, to get, not the wagon, the, uh, boat back. I don't know what happened to the boat. We winged to Tempe and then the boat was gone. There it is. All right, um... Oh, Riverton. At least mark that spot. Uh, okay, that's the Berlin area. That's Onyx. checked all these places. Let's go south. Oh, Foxville. <coughs> oh, excuse me. All right, let's... Oh, now it's daytime. I was going to say... Nighttime, we could go to Endor and we could check the. Um, come on. Nighttime. All right, let's go check the Endor chests. Still haven't found Chapter 4 land, so we can't go get Christo out of Kilion yet. And we will need to revive Ragnar to get Crystal out of Kilion too. We could also drop somebody in the Garden Bird. Uh, why is there no key? I think Ragnar had that key. I wonder if Hector took it. All right, we're going to have to hold off on this. Let's... Conenberg. So Endor is at the southeast part of the map. Uh, what's this? Seaside, we were already there. Keeves, okay, good. We found uh, Chapter 4 lands. So let's go, I believe it was up here. Yeah, here's Mumparaba. So we can go ahead, take care of the Z Helm right now.
Oh, rats. I was not thinking. I didn't bring, uh... <laughs> Tolman's telling jokes to the king. Uh, boy. We need warrant to go some tell some jokes. Yeah, I'm not really that big on taking Nara into the party, but we'd like to get somebody with a uh, sword of lethargy. So, I mean, two people with sword of swords of lethargy. Um, Let's go get Christo. The only thing is I don't want to get wagon levels, but um, which I would like Hero alive. Okay, so the only one... a little bit of HP so that when we... Oh, we did soft lock. 
No, we didn't soft lock. We can go to um, uh, Baker's Cave. Uh, let's do Tulum Bray Hero Nara. We gotta get somebody in jail too. Um, that's gonna be Mara. got wings? You do. We'll get some more wings. Unless one of you gets returned. Nope. And I'm going to do a quick save here, and then we'll head to, I believe, Baker's Cave was north of Dyer Palace. Alright, so let's see here. We'll do, I guess, Tulum, Bray, Hero, Nara. And one thing that we're going to find out about is whether or not any of them learn by kill. So that'll be a huge thing. Other thing that will be big yeah that'll probably be the biggest thing that's what we want to know from these three if any of them learns by kill Nara will already be in Saloon should already be in. Christo should be in. So preferably what we want is somebody that will learn by kill. And then that'll be the party. And then we might see if some of the non-lethargy users can equip a uh, equip stiletto earrings. So I guess that means that Alina is going to be out. No key items down here. Oh no. Darn. Baker's not there. I forgot to go to Gardenburg. 
Oops. I guess that means we're walking out of here. I mean, I guess I could reset out, but... Um, I can't remember. Did we get anything that was... I mean, I know we didn't get any key items, but... Yeah, whatever. We're already almost out anyway. Or at least halfway. Oh boy, that was a little bit of a time loss there. So we had the magic key taken from us by Hector, or the Hector character. We forgot to talk to Baker. Don't admit to stealing it. It was Mara that stole it. So stick her in prison. There we go. That's the way to do it. Alright. I gotta keep Ragnar alive. For Kilion. Alright. Let's go, Alina. Garden Burr Basement. Actually, let me do this. Let me stay at the end. Swing to Dire Palace. Back down to go get Baker. And then we can go to Kilion to get Christo out, and then we can figure out the rest of the weapons and armor, and do the town checks, and figure things out from there. Might be, uh, Colossus Crypt if we don't get the uh, Staff of Transform, but if we get the Staff of Transform, then we'll head into Actempto. Thank you. 
Darn. With a blizzag. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Let's throw an increase on. And let's throw barriers up. Go Taloon! Uh, we could probably just do an Ice Spears here, and let's do another Increase, and let's do a Speed Up. Let's do this. Hero's got a leaf, so let's throw that on to Loon. Let's get rid of these Blizzags here. Um... Don't know if fire works on them, but let's try it. Alright, anyways. Alright. We don't hit oh defense. Let's try that on Baker. Okay, so this will give us an idea of who will if anyone learns by kill, I should say. I mean it'd be nice if we could learn return too, but like it if we could use hero. By kill, he's in. Yep. Hero did it. Okay, so we're going to have hero, Nara, Taloon, and Christo. So Bray's going to get taken out. Oh, Nara's turning around. Nara's actually doing pretty good there. Okay. Didn't learn outside, right? Nope.
All right, so that means that I am going to be killing off Bray in Gardenburg Castle when we go there. And then once we get crystal, we'll just have to make sure we get him some decent armor. We have quite a bit of armor, so that shouldn't be a problem. Then we'll go search for the rest of our items. So we got our final key now. I want to stick that in somebody else's inventory, like maybe uh, Nara's. There we go. I would also like to give that Sage's Stone over to somebody else, like Hero. Okay, Bray's gone. Okay, so let's go see what's in this Garden Burr basement chest over here. Dress of Radiance. Okay, let's head to Keleon. Uh, Bray's got a couple wings here. Quick save just in case you never know what's going to happen in the fight. Now we can open up this door here. We are not soft locked like I originally thought. Ragnar, meet Ragnar. Although technically you're a fake Ragnar. All right, three Keleons. Uh, just to make sure, let's just do that on Ragnar, and you can go ahead. Let's do a speed up. Oh, that worked. Let's do some increases here. So let's do a barrier. Uh, that was Ice Spears, not Increase. Whoops. Increase. And you can just start putting them to sleep.
Nice crit. Saloon. Must be that dragon killer that's really doing all that damage. Okay, this should be some good leveling here. Saloon's already a level 34. He's killing it. Oh, and Hero learns Heal Us, too. The only other thing that I would like to learn is Return. Other than that, we're going to be in great shape. So I want to see if Taloon or Hero can equip Stiletto Earrings. There's Stiletto Earrings in Burland. Um, so I'd like to check that. Other than that, um, we're going to pretty much be ready. It's just going to be a matter of finding all the key items and getting into go mode. Okay, so now we can actually do a little checking here to see what um, Christo will equip. Uh, only the female ones can equip Dress of Radiance. That's off the table. Actually, let's do this. Let's wing to Berland. Saloon, Hero, Nara, Christo. I think the stiletto earrings were over here. Okay, Hero will take them. Let's get Aeolus's for everybody. That way we'll be prepared for the Androgues. And let's check... Um, see, let's see if somebody else will equip this Shield of Strength. Hero Ragnar. Okay, so we don't really have many people that can be equipped to the Aeolus. Let's sell... I want to get rid of some of this junk here. I guess we can't sell this, can we? No. We need to find some better armor for Christo, too. And let's get that thief's key out of his inventory. Okay, so we'll just need to see... Um, Christo for now. 
If I'm not mistaken, Conanburg had some good stuff too. Oh. Oh, Alino's got Sword Edge armor. Let's check that out, too. Let's start doing our town checks here. Can you Bronca? So let's wing to Bomalmo. We can go check out Wakanaba and buy wings while we're here. Just check Bray's stuff here too, because Bray's got some strong stuff. Oh, Nara and Christo can take that mirror shield. have a metal babble helm which we should check too. Christo, Ragnar, Bray. Let's give that over to Christo. There we go. Check Wakanaba next, which is right here. Hey, Stone and Drought. Okay. All right, so now we're going to walk to Endor, see if we can make it nighttime. 
There we go. We'll go do the night check here. Staff of Transform. So we'll use the Staff of Transform when we go over to check Dire Palace, which I think, I guess, we could probably be next. We do have to do Sand Team, but it should be fine to do Dire Palace. My guess for today is cats. Nope, it's those guys. And we beat the guy, cool. Okay, let's um, get this out of Nara's. Oops. Uh, is there any room? Yeah. Let's get the Staff of Transform out of Nara's inventory. It doesn't need to be there anymore. Let's put that meteorite armband that we just got into Nara's inventory. And we'll have her equip it since that will give her extra speed. And let's wing to Sand Team next. We'll take care of that. Then we can head over to Actempto. Okay, so we'll do a little more leveling here. Got to get the levels for Christo. Christo's the one that... What? Christo? At first, Christo seemed like he was really good, but then he kind of started slacking. But maybe he'll learn to turn and... Do a little better. He learned revive. Okay, can't knock him too hard for that. And we'll fight uh, Balzac a second time just to get primarily to get Christo the extra level here, extra levels that he needs.
Of course, the more strength that Hero gets, the stronger he'll be with the stiletto earrings, especially once he gets by kill on. to believe that uh, we've only gotten one key item so far, and it's the one that we know where it is. Vanilla Magma Staff. Huh, still haven't found... Uh... Alright, let's uh, spend our money somewhere. I remember in... Conenburr. They sold some stuff at the shop over here that looked like it was pretty good, so we'll go over there. Spend this money we got, and then we'll... Um, yeah, they have swords and... We don't need the sword mirror. Maybe a metal babble shield. Oh, Christo can take it. Okay. Um, I mean, he's got a mirror shield, but I think Nara can take that. We got a lot of junk here. Okay, let's shuffle this stuff around again. Let's see if there's something else we can grab there for almost 20,000. Let's just go. Hero's gonna get his armor through the Z stuff, so... Uh, we need to go to... Kilion, I guess? Yeah, we'll lose a bit of gold, but I don't know if we really need it at this point. Let's see what we can find down here. Hmm. 
Play Force Nuts. There you go, Taloon. Get yourself some extra max HP. Although they should probably go to Cristo, but... Oof. Still not finding any key items. Triple run fail from two hemiswords. This time, the Life Force Nuts are going to Christo. Lighthouse Bengal, huh? We're gonna do some by killing here. Never mind. No need to. All right, Christo, you gonna learn Returner outside? Key item? Z Shield, yes. Guess it's slightly better. Death Warp over here, and we will do our next uh, check, which I believe will be... I believe Christo has Revive. So I remember, actually we can walk out and we'll sail, it's in like the south part in the middle is where the oops, Cascade Cave is. I think we'll go there next. I believe 
that was... Uh, nope. Didn't get there yet. I think it's a little further over. Uh, no. This is it, I believe. The only thing is I think I didn't bring the... Uh, Second, let's get rid of this full moon herb. We need to grab stone and drought. There we go. Alright, so five chests in here, that's number two, staff of force. No, we're not looking for any stabs anyway right now, we're just looking for Z-sword, Z-armor, and gas canister. Okay, well, there's one more chest. Most likely, we're probably going to be resetting, but you never know. We could get a key item down here. cave is not too far away either, so we'll head over and check the Z-Armor cave as well. Kind of have to navigate around this island here, but once we get around it, uh, hold on a second, there it is. Ah, it just turned nighttime. All right, I'm going to try this at night. You know what? Never mind. I'm going to run back in here to Conanburg and spend the night. Okay, after that little detour, I think I'll be able to navigate the uh, Z-Armor cave a little better. And then we got the Colossus we can check, which is right up there. to check that other chest? I did, didn't I? Well, that's no good, so let's do this. Uh, wing to Riverton. We'll just do a very quick check in this first chest. Oops. And then we'll go hit the Colossus. Alright, just Mystic Acorns, no, nothing there. Alright, so we're gonna 
get out of here and go up to Colossus because it's right here. Got five chests we can check in here. Treasure map. Hey, gas canister, nice. potentially be two more key items. If it is, that'll get us right on our way. Nope. But after this, we can go check the What do you call it? We can go check God's item. Uh, that might be worth a little something. I'd hate to give it up, so let's drop it for the lunch. As a matter of fact, I didn't check to see if Nara can equip it. No. All right, let's get out of here and we will go get our hot air balloon and go check got side next. Two chests over there. And then... side is right next door too so that should be nice and easy to check here mark the return point here One place where it could potentially be is at the bottom of the Keeves Cave. Could also be up in the tree, too. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's go to... We have not found... Yeah, let's go check the tree. I believe the tree is... I thought it was... Let's do this. Oh, Soretta. It's close to Soretta, that's right. But I think it's on this big island anyway, so we'll just... Uh, did I check this? Yeah. Here's the tree. All right, so we'll just... I'm going to take Christo, because Christo has revived just in case we die going up the tree. Although, we do actually need to get another leaf, too, so maybe it's good that we did come back here. Wow. 
launch. Alright, maybe there's a... Okay. You don't let me run, but then you go and run away. That's how you play this game, huh? You gonna do the same thing? Nah, you'll just take a few, few swipes at me. You'll just go attack and then you'll go run home laughing. I see how you guys are playing the game. Dancer's costume, come on. We still haven't found the crypt yet. got three treasure chests, so it's very possible it could be in there. Otherwise, what I might do... So I might search a place that I don't really like to search, but I might check the Keeves Cave because... this one or the other side. I could always see where it takes me out. That's ah, a small metal king. It's not where we want to be. Part of me is a little tempted to want to test check the Keeves cave. That's how I found the crypt. All right, let's see. Oh, I should have brought the uh, Nara. Oh, well. Iron fan, no thank you. Alien humanoids. Hmm. Okay then, maybe there is something in Keith's cave. at the bottom of the crypt here. It's probably, I think it's going to have to be one of the key items, and then the other one's going to probably have to be in Keeves. I'm 
trying to think if I'm forgetting any other location. Okay, Z-Armor. Alright, uh, I guess we're gonna have to go to Keeves. Let me just do a quick save here, because you never know. Let me get the party in order correctly, too. There we go. Lots and lots of encounters. Okay then, um... What am I forgetting now? We did Bronco, we did Endor, we did Lakanaba. Oh, I didn't check the one condom bur chest. I wouldn't be surprised if it's here. I went through the town check so fast that I... There it is. Let's go. Let's get out of here. I need to go get more wings here. Hey, 
Hey there, Doug. All right, got side, let's go. Getting into go mode here, I, uh... When I was doing my town checks, I totally forgot to check Conanburr, and that's where the other uh, Z item was. So that kind of threw me off a little bit there, but I ended up checking every single location and then realized that... Oh, these guys are pretty strong. Look at these guys. They don't like Taloon. Taloon is like Superman in this. He is really powerful. And Hero has Heal Us. Yeah, this is a flag set where we have a really, really, really good Taloon. Um, the only insanities he could do are calling in for merchant armies or critical hits. I think he also does something else too, but it's all good stuff. And he's doing it at a higher rate than usual, so he is just like crushing it throughout this game. We got two Sword of Lethargy users in the back, Christo and Nara. Hero's got stiletto earrings and his stats are really jacked up and he's got by kill too, so. That's kind of the setup right now that we got. All we just have to do is buy kill Taloon, let him call in his merchant armies, and whoever we're fighting is toast. Actually, Taloon is a dragon killer, and he's been doing some pretty big crits. Uh, I don't even need to stop for anything here. We're just going to go... Although I don't have any Swords of Decimation, but I don't even think we need them at this point. But yeah, the other thing that happened in this seed that was interesting is... When Hector left the party, we ended up losing the magic key. So I had to go to Baker to get the fine. I mean, we still had to go to Baker anyway, but I basically uh, was about to go uh, into Endor to do the Endor check. And then I realized I didn't have the magic key, and then I forgot I was going to go into Kilion to get Christo, and I realized that I didn't have the magic key. So that kind of threw things off a little bit. So, um, yeah, that was kind of a weird thing. Usually it's not Hector that's taking it, usually it's Panon. So that, that was where things were a little weird this time around. Skiing. Woo! Heal us all. Yeah, 
All right, almost out of here. All right, let's just uh, let's go this way this time. Saloon. Whoa, that was a pretty strong hit on Christo there. Uh, do we have anything to bring Christo back? Mm, maybe not. Hmm. <laughs> nice hit by Taloon. I am not going to bring Krista back. We're just going to go fight um, up here, and then we'll wing to a... Uh, wing to go get Krista back from here. Let's buy kill Taloon. Taloon, I buy killed you so that you'll be able to do some crazy moves. I'm calling that merchant army. Oh, there we go. That was a nice crit. There we go. I mean, right now, if anyone could use the levels, it's Chris, though, but that's fine. All right, let's wing. Oh, Christo's got all the wings. Um, let's go to Serata, get Christo taken care of, and then we'll. you yet, Radom Vice. That's coming soon, though. All right, let's get the Aeoluses out.
Yeah, go Tulum. And to top things off with Hero, he learns Lightning. Do we have any wings left? If we don't... We're gonna be walking back to... Last Refuge. All right, we are ready. Ready for Necrosaro. going. Hopefully we don't get any more. Let's do this too. Heal us. down, up the stairs, down the elevator, back up the stairs, that whole fun thing. around like that with all those moves. There we go. Let's do it. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? Body is increase. Let's do increase first. Yeah, go Tulum. Let's get the buy kills on. Never mind. Try again. Buy kill on Tulum. <laughs> Still didn't get on. All right. Let's try again for the buy kill on Tulum. There we go. All right. Buy kill on Christo. Oop. I kill on Nara. Oop. There goes that merchant army with buy kill. 
All right, buy kill on hero. Oh, another merchant army. Nice. All right, now I think we're in full force here. Got our increases on, our buy kills. Funny that we didn't get buy kill on hero till phase four. Already more than halfway through the fight. Sages down here. Boop! I don't think Sages Stone's gonna hit. <laughs> Merchant armies come out and they're gonna. knock us into the next phase. Let's try this Sage's Stone again. There we go. Uh, let's do this. Try to have Crystal or Narna knock it into phase seven, see if he'll start out asleep. Be nice if we could keep our buffs till the end. I don't think it's gonna be the end of the game if we don't, but. Eh, he's asleep. All right, he's toast. <laughs> nice! Hit Taloon. That was great. Let's go. Okay, that was a pretty fun run. Three hours, eight minutes, and zero seconds. So, had to do a lot of item exploration. I think that's one of the things that, I guess you could say, slowed things down a little bit. If I'm not mistaken, well, the first key item that we got was the Z Helm, which we know where that is. But the second one we picked up was. I'm trying to remember. I actually can't remember where it was, but I just remember it was after we were doing a lot of searching, and I remember there was the gas canister in the Colossus. Oh, yeah, it was in. S Turks, because we went down, we had to kill S Turk, and then where the vanilla gas canister is, there was Z Shield there, I think. So we picked up a Z Shield there, and we got the gas canister in Colossus. We picked up the. It was in Actempto, was where. No, 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 Actempto in the crypt. We picked up, I want to say it was the Z Sword, or Z Sword was in Conimber, Z Armor was in the Crypt. So I made those extra trips into Cascade and into Keeve's Cave, up to the top of the tree, 
So those extra trips took up a little bit of time. Plus, we had Hector steal the magic key from us when we were about to go into Endor and Kilion. So that kind of threw things off a little bit. And we were trying to figure out what to do with the party because we had a lot of people that were good. We had two people. I mean, Ragnar could have taken the Sword of Lethargy too, but he was... his stats just got pretty bad, so we're just kind of like, yeah. I thought I'd not use him and use somebody else, but good thing we got Hero. He got by kill, and um, the others, they did pretty well. Nara did pretty well later on, and uh, Christo was so-so, not the greatest, but he did the job. And Taloon, he was really on fire. Most likely, I'll probably uh, suggest maybe cutting down slightly on Taloon's stuff. I mean, it's almost like with the way that he was, you could get him in any seed and he would just like crush the whole thing. And I think it's a little too much, so I think I'm probably going to suggest maybe cutting uh, him back down to vanilla to 25%. He'll still be pretty good that way, but it just kind of balances out the characters a little more. So, anyways, let me take a look on Twitch, see if anyone else is doing anything interesting on Twitch. If we want to raid somebody, or we will just end the stream. So, anyways, I'm just gonna, um probably say that I'll uh, cut or I'm gonna phase out of the stream here but either we'll raid somebody or we will uh, call it an evening so thank you all for watching and hope you have a great rest of the evening take care